still be in bed? Couldn't sleep. Oh, well, you've got a long day ahead, you know. Shouldn't you be saving yourself? I'll be fine. Don't see yourself, babe, but you wimp out on Tony's stag do. Don't expect any sympathy from me. Mm. Okay, the new. Why aren't you dressed yet? Oh my god. <laughs> Please, don't encourage him. We're going for the Scottish angle. Yeah, I kind of guessed that. You don't think it's too much? No, I think it's wicked. See, I told you. <laughs> no prizes for guessing who's having the most fun today then. It's just the booze up. What kind of talk is that, man? They may take our lives, but they'll never take. <gasps> Our freedom! I am so jealous. <laughs> You're not going to have anything? No, I'm not particularly hungry. Anyway, I thought you were kicking off at the cafe. That extra ballast never hurt. I think I'm going to require all my stamina. It's going to be a heavy session then, is it? Slim short. What happened to my lovable control freak? If I'm going to spend the rest of my life with you, I think it's best I learn to embrace chaos. Besides, the lads are not going to get it all the runway today. How do you mean? Well, let's just say, I've got a little surprise of my own. Lynette, you're keen! When it comes to you, Granger, I'm positively zealous. Mind if I come in? Read the sign. My invitation. What do you want? I don't mind if I do. Coffee, black, two sugars. This is harassment. I'd like to leave, please. I'd like them to bring back Airwolf. It isn't going to happen, though. Well, I've answered all your questions. Yeah, and every time you open that gob of yours, even the breath comes out crooked. This is me you're talking to, Becky. I know you. I've got an alibi, remember? Oh, yeah. Stephen James MacDonald. I had a little dig. He's got four. Still like the Baddens, do we? Never liked you. Touché. So, tell me about this so-called affair. Give me all the juicy details about you and the lover boy. What, you want dates and times and all that? That's exactly what I want. Why? Is that a problem? Where's your notebook? It's for some. Have you had your breakfast? No, not yet. Is there any post? Well, that note's this way. You're expecting some, No, not really. I just sent off for some info about swimming clubs. You forgot about my competition? Soph. Oh, Dad. Look, don't have a go, eh? I've got enough on my plate without you having a pop. So you're not coming now? I'll see how the morning goes. Oh, do you know what, Dad? Whatever. Give your old man a break, eh? Jim, ma'am. Hi, love. Yeah, I'm OK. A bit tired. Any news on Rosie? We shouldn't be here. Who is it, darling? It's Liam. I bet two ticks. This is messed up. You've got to call it off. Carla, wake up, will you? You need to choose me or him right now. Don't give me ultimate. No, yeah, then. To what do we owe this pleasure? I thought I'd start the day off in style. Lloyd's outside in the Merc. That's very thoughtful of you. Ready for the off? Are we, darling? Yeah, bring it on. Love the T-shirt, by the way. Good seams. They look really tight. Well, that's the idea, isn't it? According to my mum, they what the professionals use. There you go. You haven't seen them on yet. Well, do you want to give us a sneak preview? <sighs> Who have we got there? Chessie's new super trunks. 
Man bought them for him. Delivered and everything. Oh, that's nice of her. If you say so. So, um, what time do you need to leave? I'm going on the bus with Sophie. No, don't be silly. We'll take you. We've already made plans. Thanks anyway. He'll come round, honest. <sighs> okay, the champers is chilling nicely, and these little beauties are to die for. <clears throat> oh, we'll make an effort. Today's supposed to be fun, remember? <clears throat> Nails and lunch out. Sorry, but I'm hardly falling out of my chair with excitement, Michelle. Right, we're gonna need a plan B and serious reinforcements for later on. Oh, but Carla didn't want to fuss. Tough. I'll give Sean a buzz, see what we can organise. She's not going to like it. Oh, then we won't tell her, will we? <laughs> oh, well, that's me done for the day. Let the sweet madness begin. I play my song. Have a fantastic day. Don't do anything you can do. Did you hear that, Liam? That gives us some room for manoeuvre. Look after my fella, won't you? Do my best. I feel safer already. Tell him to get a boogie on. I've got some thirsty chaps waiting in here. Oi, we're on. Duty calls. Here we go. Abandon all hope. All those who enter here. What's up? Is this for real? After breakfast, we'll be doing a spot of paintballing. Yeah, assembling at 12.30 hours, hey, right? Look and low! <laughs> Who are the teams gonna be? Um, I'll, uh, we'll, we'll decide that later. So, sorry, guys, can we take the face off? They're really annoying. Yeah, that could be construed as an insult. <laughs> I want to be on Tony's team because I think the man's a real winner. I like to think so. Hey, did he say winner? <laughs> <laughs> You've made the list. Hey! Do you know what he's paintballing? Does it like hurt if he gets shot in the head? Well, that all depends if you've got outwork damaging <laughs> Oh, this is going to get so messy. Come on, guys, just a bit of fun. Then I'll remember that when I've got you in my sight. <laughs> Mistaken, the dude just threw down. Oh, Fair enough. Looks like it's all our war then. Hey! <laughs> I'm missing the fun here. That copper hooch has been sniffing round. I don't believe a story. Oh, why not? Because he's a pig and he knows a lie when he hears one. So what have you told him now? More lies. About what exactly? Us. Um. I'm afraid we've got a, a slightly complicated relationship. And we're at it like rabbits. I'm a dead man. No, come on, it's not that bad, because we get a story straight and we'll get through this. Oh. <laughs> you, uh, you keep saying we. <laughs> there's no I in friendship. I think you find there's two eyes in friendship, you... Mm -hmm. Well, I, I can't do this without you, Steve. What's the story now, then? Edited highlights only. Yeah, okay. Um, well, when we first met. You really know how I am? Years of servitude for my James. Sorry, but why are you getting tied up for my dad? You fit in a kitchen. Well, yeah, it's no ordinary kitchen, though. It's the Windasses, and they're a really big client. Besides, you said make a big impression. I did? Yeah. Tell me you didn't use those words. Every syllable. No way. That's so old for me. No offence. None taken. You look rather delicious. It must be contagious. Well, David's all spruced up for his big day with his new employer. What's your excuse, eh? He's a lucky fella. Oh, it's Dad. I beg your pardon. He's at the door. I'll let him in. Saved by the bell. Hello. Hiya. You all right? Yeah. Morning. Morning. You all set? 
Uh, yeah, just give us a sec. I'll give a final pet talk. He's, um, trying to make a good impression. Well, for me, <laughs> you're joking. You must have that effect on folk. The thing about lads these days is so we just don't take it to the max anymore. Yes, but the day is still young, so... Yeah, you're a bunch of wusses, you lot. You want to come out with me sometime, lads? I'll show you what's what. Hey. Hey. I'm always well sorry at morning. Your stag night weren't all that. Oh, hawk helmet head, the voice of experience. <laughs> You were manning the porcelain switchboard all night, as I recall. <laughs> <laughs> not as much of a lightweight as Uncle Liam. Oh, hey, come on, Liam, you're not going to take that from the kid, are you, eh? Had a good time. Can't speak for everyone else. That's not much of a comeback. I think I know where the man's coming from. I mean, let's face it, why bother about the preliminaries when the main event is Maria? Oh. Hey, come on, I'll give it that. Hey, yeah. That is so lovely. Why the hell didn't you ever say it like that to me? <laughs> yeah, five pina coladas and I'm warning you the lethal. Oh, Carla, you are an artist. I have a moment. <laughs> You've got gorgeous hands. Oh, it's her. Oh, teacher's pet. Yeah, she's never done a day's work in her life. Oh, you've all got nicer hands than me. <laughs> Stop it. Listen, when a fella starts telling you you've got nice hands, you need to worry big time. <laughs> or ankles. Or feet. Or personality. Right, it's game over. You're officially a munter. <laughs> Liam really likes my hands. Oh, we rest our case. <laughs> oh, don't tell me he's missing you already. Can you blame him? Oh, do you know what? He's such a softy underneath, Tony. <laughs> Any money, the only text I'll get from Steve today will be, where do I live again? <laughs> Still, you've got to love me. <laughs> I'll shoot him. Take pick. <laughs> Show us what he's written. No way, you're not on an empty stomach. <laughs> Speaking of which, I'll go and get some more nibbles. Mm, there's more crisp behind the bar. Right. Mm. Right, she's out of the way. Who else are we going to invite? Concentrate. Don't just blank out like you usually do. And don't touch any of my dad's precious tools, OK? They're his babies. And as for you, don't be boring David about the type of granite and marble. He's too polite to say put a sock in it. And don't be singing whilst driving. It means it's... I used to live with this. Try 17 years. Ouch! Oh, I think that's our cue to leave, kiddo. Yeah. <laughs> See ya. Bye-bye. Yeah. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Bye, good luck. Excuse me a minute, love. Could I just have a quick word? Oh, whatever it is, I haven't done it. Oh, no, nothing like that. In fact, I wanted to make you a proposition. OK. Well, you see, my colleague, Norris, he did his back a minor injury recently. Is he that relic with the attitude? <laughs> oh, you know, I couldn't have described him better myself. Look, if you want me to go over and read to him, I'm oh, sorry. Oh, no, Don't perish think. the thought. I wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy. OK. What's his proposition, then? Well, I wanted to offer you a job. In the cabin? Yes. Me and you? For the time being. I'll go £1.50 over whatever Jerry was paying you, and you can have all the magazines you can read. Now, I can't say fairer than that. End of start, boss. I said don't pressure me. It's not pressure it's how it is i love you you love me end of story you really think it's that simple no but up here it is up here it all makes sense it's a shame i'm not a mind reader isn't it but you don't have to be you know how you feel no i'm sorry i don't no, no, we're not running away from this not anymore Uh, so far, so good. I don't think he'll be back today. Bet on it, cock. That pork is like a boomerang on a less phone. Cheers. So much for positivity. Right, if anyone fancies putting on war paint, we've got plenty of colours. It's got to be something scary. I always want to look like Skeletor. Keep eating Becky's cooking. <laughs> Oi! 
by the power of Grace God! <laughs> What are we talking about? He man, the master of the universe. Come on, oh, it's an 80s thing, kid. Oh, right, okay, last century. Right? <laughs> oh. You know, I could grow to dislike this boy. The youth is definitely wasted in the young, isn't it? Hey, Tom, do you think we should start making a move? Oh, I'm the monkey. Liam's the organ grinder. Well, where's he gone? I saw him slip out a minute ago. What? And left us to our own devices. He's an amateur. Well, oh, you know, it's very sacred. This uh, best man thing, right? I'm sure he's got very good reason. Giles. Oh, Giles. Um. <laughs> Not a good time. Yep, calm down. Um, it's my counting days, my team. Ooh, I'm serious. Hey, hey, now come on, that's what I call dedication, right? Oh, he's your hero. Yeah, you want his baby. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. Ha 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 ha. No, Liam, you can't just expect me to make a decision like this right now. Don't let me save you the trouble. I'll go upstairs right now and oh, tell Maria don't be it's ridiculous. Over. We're done. Finished. I've heard this little chestnut before, though, haven't I? Are you down here, Carla? OK. If you really mean it, and it's definitely over like you say it is, prove it. Tell Michelle. We're out here, sis. <laughs> what are you doing skulking around? He's hassling me. About what? A little business bunch you're working on. Carla. Since when? Oh, it's a recent thing. What, and this is where you have all your meetings, is it? Your brother's having a mini crisis. Shouldn't be serious, but, uh, you know, oh, don't tell Tony Maria. It's meant to be a surprise. Right. You can't tell them, all right? Yeah, yawning already. Secret safe for me, don't worry. I'll get back to that party pronto and you stop pestering the lady. Would have told her. I know. Then why did you bottle it? Look, I know you don't trust me. It's not that. Then what? I don't doubt for one second that you believe everything you're saying to me right now. What about tomorrow? Hey, when it all becomes real. Well, I'm not scared if that's what you mean. Then you're an idiot, Liam. Okay, no more Mrs. Nice Guy. You, upstairs, you, get a life. We'll continue this later. Yeah, not if I have anything to do with it. Relax, Giles. You're supposed to be reassuring me. No, you listen. This conversation is over. Seriously, I need to feed the cat. A couple more hours aren't going to kill it. Oh, come on, this swimming competition's important to chairs. He's made it perfectly obvious he didn't want me there. I told you before, we're in this together. <sighs> This'll break his heart. <laughs> Don't guilt me out. Then try showing a bit of you-know-what. All right, you win, but I have to pop round to my grands later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad time, Mr. McDonald. Uh, yeah, can we do this outside, mate? Whatever you say. No idea. That looks like the police to me. Nah, oh, no. more like Carla's male entertainment. <laughs> Excuse me. Carla's got much more taste than that. <laughs> <laughs> Who's getting the bad news? That'll be me. 
Now, in order to avoid the sad and predictable Sassanite comments about fiscally shy Scotsmen, hey. I will pay for breakfast. Oh, oh. Put your money away. Oh, allow me. No, I insist. However, I would like to save myself going bankrupt, so can I suggest a kitty for the rest of the day? All right, who's holding it? That should be the best man's yeah. responsibility. I'm on it, I'm on it. Cough up, lads. For your pop! What happened to you? I'm starting to feel neglected. Uh, forgot to feed, was it? Sorry. From now on, you have my whole undivided attention. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> Funny though. <laughs> I thought you'd gone to France for that. <laughs> I'm getting married. <laughs> You've only just realised. <laughs> like you lot, but I am ready for a party. Right, no, 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 no. I'm not one for hearing the sound of my own voice. And I know we've got a busy schedule to keep today, so I'll keep this short and sweet. My life's about to change, and this is just the beginning. And although I've never seen such a shabby bunch of samples, I am very glad that you're all here to share it with me. So it's with some trepidation that I pass the day over to Liam. Do whoa, whoa, whoa. your worst, man. Go on, Liam. They could be famous last words, my friend. <laughs> Gentlemen, come on, charge your glasses. Let's drink to the last man standing. Last, last man standing. Man standing. Yeah. Thank you.